what a day to be alive. I'm grateful, I gotta say. I just posted something on TikTok, which if you don't follow me on TikTok, go check out TikTok. <laughs> but it, I just said essentially that it's okay to be proud of yourself and proud of your accomplishments. And there's a big difference between being proud and being prideful. And the reason I was thinking about that is because like, I was just thinking, and I wanted to remind people of that because I'm proud of myself right now. I'm proud of the progress that I've made in my mental health, man. It's a really cool feeling and a cool experience when like, you know, you have a thought and like that thought would have wrecked you all day or for very many hours earlier. And now you work through it really quickly. And it's like, rather, and, I mean, you could, you could, and I have in the past go through that whole thought process of like, oh shoot, really? Like still dealing with that or, you know, like, why'd that come? But instead, I'm just like, I'm staking proud and grateful. Like, I, we've come so far. I've come so far. And it's good to remind yourself of that and stay in that place. You could either go down the route of, the, you know, the, the cup is half empty or the cup is half full. And my cup is always overflowing. So I just spent a good amount of time, actually, like almost two hours ish two and a half hours working on uh some videos some some the acoustic videos that i filmed yesterday actually um between that making tiktoks adding lyrics to them it's hard sometimes for me to justify working on that stuff even though it's the, what i want to do it's hard to justify stuff that doesn't get a ton of views but in the end you never know when something's going to go viral and one of those videos could be the one that changes my career you never ever know now i'm here uh writing out a gift uh gift package Thank you um, for Kyle Kogan, who's on the channel. Uh, I want to do one. I'm going to send one also to the interviewer that interviewed me for, on the Wish bus or the Wish live stream. But that's international. And it's a process to ship international just like with the paper he got to fill out. So I will be sending one. Just <laughs> I don't feel like doing it right now. <laughs> Being honest. Well, since the post office was closed yesterday, would you like to come with me today? Let's go for a ride. So no update with the Ed Sheeran package yet. I'm curious if it's actually coming from, even though the phone number was based out of the, the US, I'm curious if it came, it's coming from the UK. But I did get a letter from Roy. I'm I'm curious, let's see what we got. Let's see, what we got. let's see, Roy. Thank you for sending, I love getting letters from you guys, or mail, it's the best. Many thanks. Oh shoot, this is cool, man. I love this. This is cool. Come on, Roy. This is how you do it. This is how you do it. Jacob, thank you so much for taking the time out of your busy day to do a card trick with me. When I first started talking to you, I have to admit I was starstruck. <laughs> I had to remind myself what was happening. Your kindness has never ceased to amaze me. Here is the card from the trick. May it be valuable someday. Preach. I love, I love that faith. Oh man, oh, I love that. I love this, Roy. This is the best. I love this. I love it, man. I love it. Taking the time out of your day, first of all, to get a card, then to handwrite the card, handwritten card, then take the, 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 the playing card that you did the trick on, sign it. I love that. May it be valuable someday. And then I love the faith in that, man. I love that. I relate to that so much because I sign everything. And sometimes I date them, you know, so that you know when it's from. But if I like when I'm doing these interviews and stuff, I sign it. The reason I sign it is if they want to hold on to it and it might be worth something someday. I believe that. And Roy, I love that. This is amazing. I love this. Thank you. Genuinely. That is cool. And actually, now that I think of that, I love this even more because... To my understanding, I mean, unless I'm wrong, and I, I really actually know nothing about <laughs> card tricks, but like, I assume that that deck is no longer good because like it's missing a card. So I, unless you adjust accordingly with the the decks and the cards and stuff and knowing, but I don't know. And I think that that is sick that he would be willing to, to take a card from the deck and potentially have to buy a new card or deck um, for that. That's, that's, I love that, Roy. I love that. Yo, yeah, this was live right now, home free. Just said yo in the chat. Oh, look at that. Uh, Kelly Willie. I don't think that's Shout accurate. out to that's Kelly. Really Hi, Kelly. Look at this, you guys. We are posting the first official video of the Vlogs and Reruns channel. Uh, it's cool, man. I just watched a couple of minutes of the vlog, and one thing I realized is that I want to bring music back into the vlogs. Like, just a little background music just kind of creates this cool, feel good feeling inside of it. So, that's going to be coming back. <clears throat> it takes a little more time, but I think it'll be worth it. Secondly, uh, I was just cool, man, just to see the, the progress. Like, I had talked about just hitting 10,000 followers, which was, like, at that point, because it was, like I said, uh, late November. So it was about a month after hitting 10,000 followers or subscribers. It, we talked about just starting the Patreon and people signed, the three people that signed up. Like, it's just so cool to see the progress, man. It's so, it, it is, I like this channel a lot. This is going to be a, a cool channel, man.
I really like this. So today is the first day and we were about to publish it. Boom. There it is. <laughs> Go follow it if you haven't followed it yet. Okay, so full disclosure today. I genuinely have no desire to go live and live stream today. <laughs> Number f mainly because I want to songwrite and I, I don't know, I'm just, I'm not in the mood to songwrite today on live. And I'm just showing, the reason I'm telling you this is just cause you, cause I want you to basically see all the sides, all the aspects of, of life. But we're gonna push through. It's 4.30, there's a couple things left on my list. And we're, so we have to, I wanna practice for at least like a half an hour. We're gonna work on music, I have to edit the vlog and I wanna reach out to sponsors. So with those things, if I can do a half an hour on music, working on music, we'll be good. Look at this, shout out to Marvin. One year anniversary of being a Team Tuto member. Mad shout out to you, bro, thank you. All right, so look at the progress we made today. So we got the intro. Shout out to everybody in the chat to help write this. Everything from running errands to the time I met your parents. All I want is us to share this. I'm a better me when I'm with you. Verse. Everything I always knew from the start. Nothing could ever, ever stay us apart. We're doing everything we want to do. I'm a better me when I'm with you. And then we have to write this. Da 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 bum 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 ba da bum 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 Chorus Everything from running errands To the time I met your parents All I want is us to share this I'm a better me when I'm with you Hold on now just a moment You know I know we know it Don't go just stay and own it I'm a better me Then outro chorus Better me, better you Best point about Something like that Better me, better you. I'm a better me when I'm with you. And then back to the verse. Da 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 bum bum. Ba da da bum bum. Ba da da bum bum. I'm a better me when I'm with you. Ah, uh, shoot, man. I just went through some of these YouTube comments. <laughs> I have a big, big folder of just like these, I guess, rude YouTube comments just because I want to document the process and like just, you know. It's show that everybody gets them. I haven't done anything with them yet, but like, you know, in the future one day, like far down the line, I plan to, but I just want to share a couple of these because I just added two new ones. Uh, this is a good one. <laughs> Stick to producing, brother. That was as flat as a freshly steamrolled sidewalk. Okay. Uh, here's another one. Sorry, but you can't sing at all. It hurts to listen. Here's another one. Let's see what else we got. You know, you are not a good music maker. You should get another job. <laughs> That was the same person. Three comments from the same person, actually. And I hate your personality, too. <laughs> oh, shoot. If you can't handle these comments, uh, you should not be doing social media. Keep your day job. Another one. <laughs> you need a voice teacher to improve your voice. Oh, man. There's so many of them. And there's so many ones about... The, those are just the music ones. And there's so many about, like, uh, reaction videos and stuff. And people can get very rude. <laughs> but you know what, though? It's just... It comes to the job and you know what? Hey, I am taking vocal lessons. I finally started and I'm personally seeing difference and we'll see what other people do. But sometimes it hurts, but at the point I'm almost like, I don't really care. And you know what? 98% of people won't ever even hear me sing live. They'll just hear the studio version and the studio version sound great. So what does it even matter to some degree? Yes, I want to be better at performing live, but it's also not the end all be all. I don't really care. Currently purchasing my flight tickets to LA. Now, unfortunately, what the? What happened?